Yo, what's going on YouTube? This is Zach with IT Career Questions. Today I'm going to talk to you guys about my progress so far studying for my Security Plus. Stay tuned. Before we begin any further, I want to let you guys know that this video is sponsored by CompTIA. And CompTIA, of course, is the organization that develops the Security Plus certification. They also have an amazing platform called CertMaster Learn. I'm utilizing this platform to study for my Security Plus. And if you guys haven't checked out my video where I review the CertMaster Learn platform, make sure you guys check out the link in the description because it is really good. The practice questions on there are fantastic and the performance-based questions are really something that nobody is doing so they really nailed it on that one so let's get into this video talk about our progress so far with the security plus because there have been a lot of things that i've been learning on here that maybe i wasn't quite familiar with a hundred percent or just getting more knowledge into some of these different areas within security have just opened up my eyes and have been really helpful to me. So I've enjoyed my progress so far. I'm only about five lessons in on the CertMaster Learn platform and so far enjoy every bit of it. And I'm gonna go over a few of the things that I think have been the most important and the most enjoyable and also the most surprising that I've learned just within the first five lessons. So one of the first things that you kind of learn about on the Security Plus course here is different frameworks and different concepts. Now this is really important because this really gives you a baseline of what is expected within the cybersecurity realm. It kind of gives you a greater understanding of the different things that you are protecting or securing and why you are securing them. It also gives you kind of a step-by-step -step on the different processes in which you would take to secure these things within an environment and kind of the policies and things that go behind that. So this is really, again, very crucial to learning and understanding cybersecurity or security in general because these concepts are used across the board. So any organization that's utilizing a cybersecurity team is using one of these frameworks or multiple of these frameworks to make sure that their environment is secure and they're following a standard protocol. So this, again, is really important. And understanding this information will greatly help you later on in your cybersecurity career as well. So another area that I really enjoyed learning more about was the different malware techniques, different social engineering concepts. There was a lot of information in there, a lot of information that I really wasn't too clear on before, but after going through the course, I was really much more confident in the information that I had gathered there. So understanding how some of the different malware techniques and things like that work, I think it's really helpful, again, as you're going through your career, because now you have an understanding, because maybe if you're gonna be a pen tester or something, for instance, you can have a better understanding of how some different malware will interact within your environment and things like that. And again, and then they talked about social engineering as well, a lot of different social engineering techniques. That's great information information to know as well. So really what they're doing here is they're giving you a great fundamental knowledge covering a many different areas within security so that you could kind of understand these general concepts within the cybersecurity realm. And this is really important because if you are unfamiliar with some of these different things, if you're going into the Security Plus course, you're really going to walk away from it gaining a lot of knowledge about some of these different things. And I think that's really important. Here's one of the things that I was really excited to see really quickly within the Security Plus course, and that was them talking about Metasploit. Now this is a tool that is widely used within the cybersecurity field, and just seeing that it is being talked about, that it is being used within the Security Plus course is great news. Now they just kind of went over a few general areas with using Metasploit, and they stated that later on within the course, they're gonna talk more about it and get more into detail about that, which was really exciting to me. But just the fact that they're introducing you to some of these different tools was really exciting. So knowing that you're going through the Security Plus course, they're talking about some of these tools that are used within the security field right now and having an understanding of what they actually do and why they're being used. Again, that's really important. These are tools that you can go and download 
right now if you want and you can start learning about them as well but i strongly suggest that you guys go through the security plus course and understand what it is that they're talking about what it is they're doing with them and how they're being used another tool that i was really excited to see them talking about right away was wireshark and again this is another tool that they talked about right off the bat and they stated that they're going to talk later on in different lessons more in detail about this but again the fact that they are giving you this information and giving you a general understanding of why Wireshark is used, how it's being used, is really crucial to understanding different areas within security and understanding some of the different concepts. Now, within the few lessons that they talked about Wireshark, they did give you examples and you could follow along, which again, was really awesome. So you could download Wireshark, follow along with them so you can actually understand what it is they're doing. You could actually apply it to a real world scenario and have a better understanding of how this works. And that was one part of the course that I really enjoyed. Being able to apply something in real world scenario was awesome for me. So those were just a few things that I wanted to cover that I thought were really important to my progress. Now, of course, there was much more that I learned, but I am i can't go over everything. I can't give you guys all the details, of course, but I think those were really key aspects within the Security Plus course that I'm learning so far, and I wanted to share those with you because understanding some of these things that I went over in this video are things that are utilized on a daily basis or things that you need to understand on a daily basis. So that's why I wanted to talk to you guys about these things today, because I think they're important. And I'm really happy that these are things that I'm learning currently. And I'm really excited to see what else I start learning going forward. You guys are gonna see more videos where I give you my progress. So make sure you guys stay tuned for those. If you guys are interested in taking your Security Plus, I'm gonna give you guys a link in the description below so you can sign up for the CertMaster Learn program. I highly recommend it. I've enjoyed every single minute that I've been involved in that platform and I could not say better things about it. So make sure you guys go check that out and make sure you check out my other videos where I talked about that platform as well. If you guys have any questions at all, make sure you hit me up in the comments below. And that's all I got for you guys today. So as always, take it easy.